Hi everyone, this is Swati and uh, today I'm going to talk to you about the current transit of planet Venus to its mole Tricona sign that is Libra from 18th of September to 13th of October 2024. And since Venus is a very important planet for all of us, it is going to affect everyone across the world in a tremendous manner. Now you must be thinking that why I am sitting in such a comfortable manner on the sofa and talking to you guys because that's the whole point of Venus and Libra. Venus is in its own sign which means that Venus will be very comfortable just like this, just like the way I'm sitting here in very comfortable clothes uh, with something I love on the sofa. So um, guys you will feel very comfortable right now you will feel relaxed and especially because Venus uh, was in uh, Virgo and was debilitated for a pretty long time. Venus was also with Ketu and uh, uh, Venus and Ketu of course very tough thing for Venus because Venus is materialistic, Ketu is spiritual. Uh, these two planets have a clash so definitely I'm sure you guys were having that difficulty in relationship for a pretty long time but now you will feel quite uh, you will feel you'll get the ability to balance and handle relationships and do things in a better way. Uh, so Venus and Libra is very much balanced, as in uh, in relationship, Venus and Libra is very calm because just imagine yourself inside your own room, inside your own house, uh, wearing the clothes uh, where you don't have to uh, satisfy anyone. You know, uh, doing things you love and being very comfortable. So see, with Venus, we associate Venus with beauty, jewelry, and uh, you know, luxury and all that. That's fine. I know Venus is that. But uh, Venus has also another side that is happiness. Venus, uh, Venus is also about love. Venus is about uh, finding something beautiful inside you. So this is the time when you guys should find something beautiful inside you and uh, Venus also gives that stability in life uh, as in that right now if you are an artist especially and we all know that uh, Venus is related to artist uh, if you are an artist then in that case you will not create because you have to satisfy anyone you are not going to create just because you need money but right now you will create just for the sake of art like uh, because you want to create and if people like it, it's fine. And if they don't, it's okay for you and you give a damn about it. But then coming to other people, uh, let's see Venus. Uh, Venus is also about, Venus and Libra is also about those people uh, who are balanced uh, in their life. So right now, as I spoke about balance, uh, so if you are a lawyer, if you are a judge, if you are a diplomat also, because diplomacy is also very much related to the Venusian energy where you're getting the capacity to talk to people with balance, with a calmness. You know, for example, um, let's say you have to negotiate a deal or let's say you have to talk to people around you, but let's say you have to talk to two people and both are enemies of each other. It can be in any situation. I'm not saying that you have to be a diplomat. You can be talking to your family members. You can be talking to your school friends, your college friends. Uh, when you're talking to them, uh, that time uh, you have to speak in a manner that it doesn't offend anyone. So right now, all of you will gain the capacity to talk to people in a very calm, soothing manner without affecting. Because guys, that is exactly how Venus operates. And also this is the time for everyone across the world to um, uh, kind of not be prejudiced. Sometimes we think that if a person is, um, you know, the, the, the prejudiced thinking is uh, just like you see uh, the way the world was shaped. Um, we had the European and the Western countries who dominated the world. If you if you have read history for a long time, and it was white supremacy all the time, and the black people or the brown people of whether it's the developed uh, countries or the third world countries, which is of course an offensive word, 
it it was regarded that the brown and the black are inferior and the white is superior and we still are having debates and there's so much of uproar about it and it was so unjust to the entire world so the kind of r- racism which is there that that prejudice thinking that when you see a white person you see oh this is the person is white so must be rich must be very intelligent and i i should give more importance to that person of and it's a black person or a brown person or oh, she is ugly or oh, she is not talented or oh, she is not capable of doing anything you know those kind of prejudice thing this is the time when venus is in libra uh this is the time to let go of your racism let go of your prejudice let go of your stereotype thinking and become more open become more liberal because the word liberal also comes from libra become more liberal towards people and listen to people what they're saying and not talk too much listen to them and try to be balanced in your decision uh be open mind try to understand the other person's point of view also not just what you are thinking and this is also a, a period where many of you will get very amazing life partners soulmates good relationship this is a good time because especially for men you can find a woman who is very very balanced in her thinking who allows you to do what you want to do and who is not prejudiced like let's say you are a man and you have many female friends uh so the, the your girlfriend uh, will be or your wife if you find a wife or a girlfriend will be okay with you hanging out with your female friends because uh because uh, venus in libra is especially librans uh they understand they are they they uh they are very fine in their thinking they are not very hard or they are not very uh how do i say dominating uh they they allow that freedom uh, in relationships so uh some of you will develop that capacity because just now venus came from virgo and was debilitated it was not a, it was in a bad phase so venus has come out so people so you guys will come out from a bad relationship and you will understand the importance of not being a possessive boyfriend a possessive girlfriend or a possessive husband or a possessive friend also i'm not saying it's only limited limited to romantic relationships but all kind of relationships it can be a mother father uh it can be relationship with a mother or your father or your or your sibling but right now you will be a little bit uh, uh i will say liberal if you are finding a person right now high chance will be a very very good person well guys this is also a time when uh many of you will find uh female doctors or uh, female gurus or female mentors who will guide you and protect you and help you they might give you some medicine which will be useful for you and actually i'm sharing one of my own experience where uh, i was having this throat issue especially jupiter is in uh, taurus right now and venus is in libra so somehow and mars is in adra nakshatra with all these planetary combination i got this throat issue and um and i i went to a uh, I went to the hospital and I found suddenly out of the blue I found a female doctor who was very very amazing and these days uh, actually honestly some doctors are really horrible and they don't know they give the wrong medicines also but I was lucky enough she was an amazing lady and she was very she was she was very much like Venus uh, I mean she had this uh, she she was very well dressed in uh she had she had she had kind of uh, dyed her hair and she looked beautiful and she was very intelligent and she knew the correct medicines to give and she gave me the right medicines very quickly she gave me and i took them and in few days i was okay so yeah some of you will get will be lucky enough to find uh, a very good female doctor and uh, you will be healed and uh, if women uh, you are dealing with issues with your reproductive organs like menstrual issues or anything anything related to the reproductive organs or mothers also uh, ladies also if you are having so this is also a good time when venus will protect you because venus uh, rules those houses so venus will help you come out of these health problems as well very good time for healing because as i as i told you uh, in the beginning that venus is not just about uh, beauty and uh, 
um, relationship love romance no venus is uh, venus is also venus is also in indian traditional astrology is also called uh, shukracharya you know shukracharya who is one of the greatest uh, teacher uh, in our mythological stories uh, jupiter uh, brihaspati is very powerful but shukracharya is equally powerful and sometimes it is also said that shukracharya has all those knowledge wisdom power and capacity of the dark world also some dark secrets the underworld and so many other information uh, shukracharya has which uh, brihaspati was not having uh, you know all those things so shukracharya is very very a powerful guru so my point is that right now uh, many of us will be blessed with knowledge and uh, especially knowledge of uh, the unknown world and also shukracharya has the power to heal because the story says that shukracharya had the sanjeevani uh, and he, sanjeevani was something which which bring someone alive from the dead he had the power to make a dead person alive well it's just a story but if we see how it impacts our life so uh, something which was dead will come back once again in your life i also see because venus ketu venus was with ketu for for some period of time recently and it is this crossed ketu to libra so some of your dead relationship must have come back alive once again or something which was dead uh will like it is already come back alive uh, as in as in like uh, a passion project which you thought i will do it but you didn't do it and you left it now suddenly you will do it once again because venus is also about love passion passion as in passion is not just love passion is passion for music passion for art like it can be passion to write a journal also it can be a passion to uh gardening uh, you know planting trees also so something which you left doing you will start doing it once again so that's all for today and i will uh, have a part 2 of this same uh, venus transit to libra uh, tomorrow so watch this space to know more about this transit and how it's going to affect your life um and how you can utilize the knowledge of astrology to make your life more powerful and for consultation you can always contact me in the number 9082496693 you can whatsapp me or you can email me at phoenixtarolady@gmail.com thank you so much for watching this video